well, 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 we are ready to start. Let's fix everybody so we can start our class right now. In them. Hello, Katia. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Hey, look, we are wearing hey. a uniform today. <laughs> yes, I see. How are you? I'm fine, teacher. Thank you. How about you? Fine, just fine, I could say. It's Friday. Ah, uh, yes. And tomorrow is a sweater. I don't know how to say. Well, it's a holiday, not really. Holiday. Well, I'm going to teach a class tomorrow morning. Um, work tomorrow. I'm sorry? 
I will not <laughs> work tomorrow. Oh, that's cool. No, in my case, I have to teach a private class. That's why. So I'm going to be busy. I have to. I will rest tomorrow. That's cool. That's nice. I mean, it's nice once in a while. I have a vez cuando, bueno, but for me, with Sunday is enough. Para mí, el domingo es suficiente. It's just that, I mean, Descansa. I'm not that much into resting. My problem is that I, I think I am kind of a workaholic. Do you know that expression, Katia? Mm -hmm. Work, workaholic. More or less. I'm addicted to work. Um, I am addicted to work. Soy adicto al trabajo. Um, I know. So, I mean, it, for me, when I get vacations, like in, in December, the last the last week, I always get insomnia. I'm desperate to go back to work. I know. So, I love rest. Take relax sometimes. I love. Yeah, for me it's okay. One week stops. Para mí está bien. Because I like to travel. I, I like it so much. That's cool. But yeah. because my work I, I, is difficult to uh, travel. Yeah. Only in December and sometime Semana Santa. Easter. Easter. Easter, okay. that's the way you say Semana Santa. That's actually Easter. Como Pasco. Yep. That's Semana Santa. In English, you call it Easter. Now, let me see. Yeah, I like to travel, but as I told you, I mean, for me, one week is okay. Two weeks, acceptable. More than that, oh, it's terrible. I get desperate. I fix everything in my house. Arreglo todo en la casa. I fix the, the roof, arreglo el techo, I paint the house, I paint the doors. I fix uh, the plumbing, reviso la fontanería, I check the electricity. Good teacher. Man, but I get, I get desperate. For me, the pandemic, it was terrible. I was cleaning the house every day, all day. Yeah, tell me about the it. Beatles. It was terrible, so terrible. Okay, just let me check something. Oh, Elena, she finished uh, the platform. That's cool. Actually, I already, creo que ya lo revisé. Okay, well, thank you, Katia. Nice talking to you. Always nice talking to you. Thank you, teacher. Basilia, hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. How was your day? Very good. That's yes. Cool. What did you do today? Tell uh, me the, the new activities, all the new activities oh, you performed this day. Uh, uh, went to the pool. Again? That's now? Cool. Again? Yes. In the afternoon. That's nice. Yes. Can you swim? I don't like pool and only my sons swim. Okay, and you cannot swim? No, I don't like. Oh, come on. I love <laughs> swimming. In my case, I uh, love swimming. Yes. It, that's my one. Love, my he loves the pool. Yeah. But he can swim. Swim. He can swim. Mm. He can swim. But I like. To jumping in the okay, pool. that's nice. Yeah, kids are like that. 
Yeah. You know, you should do what I did with my son. Debería hacer lo que yo hice con mi hijo. I was in the pool. I was floating. Yo estaba flotando. And he asked me, is it deep? Pronto que se estaba profundo. And I told him, no, I'm standing up. So he jumped. He went down <laughs> and he went up. That way he learned. Así aprendió. Oh, well, in the future, because... It's a little, my son is a little. <laughs> okay, okay, I that's... Have, I have miedo. What I have. Yeah, oh. Yo tengo miedo que se ahogue. <laughs> I am afraid. I am afraid. Yes, I am afraid of him drowning. Yeah, of course, we have to be careful. <laughs> yes. You know, I can swim. And I used to spend, when I was a teenager, cuando yo era adolescente, I used to spend all, all my holidays and vacations at the beach. Yo pasaba oh. todas mis vacaciones en la playa. I got relatives in, uh, in El Tunco. Oh. Yeah. I got many relatives there. And believe me, I never learned how to swim in the ocean. Nunca aprendí a nadar en el mar. I can swim in a river, I can swim in a pool, but never in the ocean. And my, and my cousins, my nieces and my nephews, they all surf. Ah, oh, they surf. Primo, nice. Mis primos, mis sobrinos, todos surfean. But oh. in my case, I cannot. I never learned how to swim. Well, you know, uh, uh, oh, do you know the surfer who passed away? Recuerda la surfista que falleció hace poco? Oh, yes, the, the okay. strong. The, yes. The, yeah, the, the, the lightning. She was I my niece. Light. Ella era mi sobrina. Really? Yeah, so I, as I, I tell I you. I can do it the, the noticia. I can do it the news, but yeah. no lo podía creer. Yeah, well, it was terrible. But as I yeah. tell you, I got all my relatives, they can swim, they can surf, and I cannot mm -hmm. swim in the ocean. That's oh. shameful. <laughs> Penoso. <laughs> well, welcome yeah. to the class, Basilia. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Mario, hello. Hey, you finished the platform, Mario. Congratulations. Excellent. Good evening, teacher. Good uh, evening. Yeah, yes. Uh, I am I am in work uh, in the platform form and yesterday and, and today. And today is correct. Yeah. Is correct. Step by step, but you did it. Yeah. Paso paso, but you finished it. That's cool. That's great. Yeah. That's great. Actually, in my group, I'm just waiting for two students right now. Solo dos estoy esperando. Okay. Okay. Thank you, teacher, but, uh, uh, for your. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. For you. Never mind. For that. your support, for your support, and never, wait for me. <laughs> never mind. Never mind that. No se fijen eso. Okay. I mean, it's it's part of my job, and it's something that I I gladly do. Es algo que lo hago con gusto. I like. I mean, actually, you know, I like it when I hear my students speaking in English. That's that's what I like. That's awesome for me when you feel like the confidence. So thank you, Mario, for working. I know that it's hard. It's been hard, but you did it well. Yeah, yeah. And uh, the, uh, yesterday, uh, when uh, uh, come back to my home, uh, I a little sick. Oh, really? Uh, yeah, yeah. Cold, cold? Cough. Cold, cold. Cough. 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 Yeah. Cough. Uh, congestion and cold, creo que es. Oh, no, 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 no. That's a nasal congestion. Uh, repeat me. Nasal congestion. Ah, nasal congestion. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Nasal congestion. But in this moment, uh, very good. Very good. I have take. Uh, uh, medicine and a 
in this moment, very good. And ready for the class. Ready for the class, that's cool. Okay, and now with that expression that you told me, uh, you can say it uh, nasal congestion, or you can say it, this is informal, this is not the correct form, but some people say it like that. Stuffy news. Now, I got another expression. When you got, cuando uno tiene no solo la congestión, sino que tiene la secreción, la mucosera, you have a running nose. A running nose. Okay? A running I'm sorry, uh, I misspelled it. Perdón, lo de la tren mal. Nus. Mano. The double O is nudo. I'm sorry. Uh, My bad. Stuffy nus. 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 Stuffy nus. 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 Yeah. And okay. Or a running nus. You can mm. say a running nus. A running nus. Yeah. Okay. It's weird because running is correr, right? Like, but remember running, running news. <laughs> yeah we have remember we have a running news and it's a problem with people got smelly feet <laughs> okay those expressions in english are weird it's like uh it's like uh, uh oh for us in spanish novio novia is just two expressions right novio novia uh, perhaps Prometidos, but we don't use that that much here. Comprometidos, we just say novio, novia, even the day that they go to the, to the, aún el día que se casa. But in English, you have a boyfriend and girlfriend, right? We have boyfriend and girlfriend. But then, cuando se dan el anillo, it's fiancé. And fiancé. And the day of the wedding y el día de la boda, they are uh, groom, que es el novio el día de la boda. And the lady is the bride. Some words that are like very specific. There are some things that are funny. Like uh, I'll give you an example, guys. Park. What is to park? Related to cars. Park is in parque, right? But related to cars? What do you think when you hear the word park? Cuando hablamos de cars relacionado con los automóviles. Parquearse, no? Estacionarse. Okay. But what about parkway? That's a different uh, expression. When you say a parkway, you are talking about an avenue. Es otra manera de decir avenida. When you say park is parking, but no, in English, parkway is an, it's an avenue. And a driveway, it's something different. You cannot you cannot park in a parkway, but you can park in a driveway. Usted no se puede parquear en un parkway, pero sí lo puede hacer en un driveway. And drive is conducir, right? Manejar, conducir. But what is the driveway? Hmm. Okay, imagine you have your house. Here is the street. La ramplita que está entre la calle y la cochera, that's the driveway. That is space. So you can park there. Usted puede parquear ahí. So you can park in the driveway, but you cannot park in the parkway. It's funny, right? Es un poquito raro, ¿no? Well, let's continue. Let's continue. Emily, hello. 
Sisters. How are you? Fine. How was your day, Emily? Tell me. Oh, it was so good because it's, it's Friday. It's Friday. Okay. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me, what do you usually do on Fridays when you don't have this class? Cuando no tiene esta clase, what do you usually do on Fridays? I watch, I watch movies with my parents. I go to the cinema. I okay. You can say go I to, go to the movies. You can also say I go to the movies. It's another I expression. The it's the movie. same. It's the same. I go to the cinema and I go to the movies. The same. So you go to the movies. Perfect. What else? Or I go to eat pupusas. Oh, terrible <laughs> option. That's a bad option. No, teacher, I love pupusas. <laughs> I don't, I don't. Oh, come on. So there's no dancing on Fridays. Come on, Emily. Fridays are for going dancing with friends. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> I can't dancing. You cannot dance? <laughs> Come on, Emily, dancing is cool. Well, interesting. No. Interesting, interesting. Thank you very much, Emily, and welcome. Thank you. Mr. Reynaldo, hello, how no, are you? Guarda. Hello, how are you? I'm just fine. What about you? I'm fine too. Hey, you changed the position. Cambio de lugar. Yes, uh, I I am in mother-in-law house. Oh, yeah, because that is not your usual spot or position. Yes. That's not your usual spot. Oh, so you are visiting your in-laws. You are visiting your in-laws. I love. In Laos, yes. In Laos, in Laos. It's, it's in Soyapango City. Oh, really? Uh, yeah. What, what part of Soyapango? I used to live in Soyapango. Uh, in, um, Los, Los Santos 2 near Unicentro. I know Los Santos Behind. Dos. Behind San Fernando. Behind. Yes, San Fernando. San Fernando? Yep. Sí, right, yes, next Fernando. Is, right next um, to the corner. Be, uh, okay, okay. Behind the hospital's uh, psychiatric. 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 Yes. psychiatric. Psychiatric. Okay. Yes. Tell me what what uh, what street? ¿Qué pasaje? And uh, four. 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 One, two, four. three, four. It's in the big parking lot. There room. are a mini park. Yeah, it's there a are big, mini parks in front. Yeah, because it before it used to be a big parking lot. Como, Antes como era un parqueo grande. Yes. Ah, yes. I, I grew up now, uh, in those streets. Yo crecí, ah, yo crecí caminando yeah. esas calles. Yeah. I know. Ah, that. Okay. Ah, ah. You know. <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah. I know so yeah. It's beautiful. Yeah. I mean, my teens, uh, in my teens, I used to Walk all around Soyapango. En mi adolescencia, yo vivía en Soyapango. So uh, I know all that area. What neighborhood? Right next to it, in Bosque de Prusia. Ah, yeah, near here. Near yeah, here. my parents still live there. Ah, yeah. Yeah. I don't live uh, in Soyapango. Never, but uh, okay, it's a okay. beautiful city. Okay, uh, yeah. present perfect. I have never I, lived. I have never been. No, I have never lived. Lived. Uh, yeah. So I have I never, have never lived. lived in Soyapango. Perfect. That's okay. the expression. I have never lived in Soyapango. Well, yeah, I, I lived there for like. 10 years, no, 11, 12, 12 years. I lived there for 12 years. Yo vivía ahí 12 años. 
Wow, the twelve years. Yeah, it's changed. It's yeah, changed, uh, Pango. Everywhere has changed with the past. There are time. many. There are many. How do you say portón? Gates. Portón. Gates. Gates in the in the many neighborhoods. Yeah, it's difficult. The the street, the walk. Yeah, because of the delinquency, people want to be yeah. safe. Yeah. Well, nice talking yeah. to you. You brought back me memories. Me. You yeah. brought I... back memories. You brought back oh. memories. Yes. yes. Me trajo recuerdos. Yeah. You brought back memories. Nice talking to you. Thank you very much, Reinaldo. Thank you, teacher. Hey, let's see who else is around. Herling, hello, how are you? Hi, hey, teacher, good evening. I'm good. fine, and you? I'm just great. Okay. It's good. Tell me, Herling, what are the plans for the weekend? Um, I, is, I hope I study all the weekend. Oh, come on. <laughs> for the master. Yes, I need you study. <laughs> but I have, uh, I'm really happy because tomorrow is holiday, right? Yeah. Yes. Yes. So you're we like, yeah. rest. Yes, we, I rest more. Okay. More in the morning. Yes. Oh, so you will sleep late? Yes. Yes. 10 a.m. <laughs> I hope. 10 a.m. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah. cool. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah. Well, <laughs> enjoy your weekend. That's cool. Excellent. Yeah, Thank you very much, Caroline. <laughs> okay, teacher. Thanks. Humberto, hello. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. I'm fine, and you? I'm just great. Just great. Here, having long conversations with everybody. So tell me, what about you, Humberto? What are your plans for the weekend? What you going to do? I I I will um, paint. Oh really? Continue paint. I I, re, I I will continue paint my house. Painting. The, I will continue painting. painting my house. Okay. I will continue painting my house in in outside. Okay. In outside. Uh, the rest of the house oh, is complete. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, you just remind me that I have to paint the garage, but uh. <laughs> yeah. I have the paint like from two months ago. Tengo la pintura de hace dos meses, but I never have time. I never stay home. Nunca paso en casa. That's the problem. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, and, but uh, I'll and, do it. I'll do it. Okay, my my day, um, my holiday to of tomorrow. Um, really work it really re really will work <laughs> okay yeah but that's what we do i mean some of us like to work Algunos nos gusta to work around mm -hmm. around the house when you say this when you say i like to work around the house you are expressing a eso es hacer los pequeños arreglos que la casa necesita okay that's okay. to work around the house okay and on here, my wife is the is the boss. Okay. Uh, been there, done that. Been there, done that. Believe me. In my case, look at this expression, guys. Been there. Okay. Been there, done that. It means uh, been there, done that. Quiere decir, uh, lo entiendo, ya lo he vivido. Actually, okay. the correct expression will be, lo correcto sería, I have been there and done that. Oops, been, been, I'm sorry. Been. I have, I have been there and done that. Yeah, yes. Okay. Ya he pasado por eso. And the most correct, correct expression Sentence, I mean, that comes from, eso viene de, I've 
been there, done that, and got the t-shirt to prove it. Okay. Got the t-shirt, the camiseta. The, the situation is this. Uh, have you noticed that Americans, when they like got a meeting, uh, anything they do that involves a big group, dando cuenta que los americanos cuando hacen tienen cualquier cosa reuniones o algo que envuelva un grupo grande they get a t-shirt mm -hmm. hacen una camiseta para todo el mundo even when there's family gatherings aun cuando hay reuniones familiares grandes they do a t-shirt so that's where the expression comes from de ahí viene la expresión I've been there and done that and even got the t-shirt to prove it Ya he pasado por ahí, lo he hecho, y hasta la camiseta tengo para probarlo. But uh, now, with the pass of time, it became shorter to uh, being there, done that. Okay? Okay, teacher. Well, thank you, guys. It's always nice talking to you. We always get new expressions. These, yes. are, these are medicines. I mean, that's not something that you actually find in a book. Eso no es algo que vamos a encontrar en un, en un libro. I mean, that's everyday speaking. It's colloquial English. Even though... I, I remember I remember um, some some that uh, in in English um, ¿Qué se llama el, el anterior? <laughs> el bas, be, básico. Basic. English, English basic, and the models. Oh yeah, models are something different also. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you guys. Let's go back to our work. Do you remember that? Thank you very much, Humberto. And do you remember guys that yesterday we were talking about uh, the present perfect, okay? Yesterday we say, well, the day before yesterday, anterior, we said that present perfect is used to express something that started in the past, continues. Yesterday, we said that the present perfect is used to express also, también, uh, something that happened at an indefinite moment, okay? Now, we are going to work with some other expression. And also yesterday, we use already and yet, right? Y también ayer trabajamos con el already and yet, right? Already, that means uh, ya and yet, um, aún, okay? But now we are going to add a little bit more. Pero hoy le vamos a poner un poquito más, okay? Let me please share with you the video with the grammar explanation in which I'm going to base my personal explanation. Let me share it. Here we go. Okay, there's Jessica. This lesson we will learn when to use present perfect versus simple past. What we're about to watch is question form in present perfect. Notice the way to answer. Present perfect versus simple past. Use the present perfect for an indefinite time in the past. Use the simple past for a specific event in the past. Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? Yes, I have. I ate it once in Paris. No, I haven't. I've never eaten it. Have you ever had green curry? Yes, I have. I tried it several years ago. No, I haven't. I've never had it. Okay. Now let's I've never eaten it. Look at it. Okay. Have you ever, have you ever asked to alguna vez? Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? Moroccan is uh, Marroquí. Yes, I have. I ate it once. I ate it once in Paris. No, I haven't. I never eaten it. Have you ever had green curry? Yes, I have. I tried it several years ago. No, I haven't. I've never had it. Have you ever had, okay, green curry? Now, when we say, have you ever, remember, ask tú alguna vez. That's the idea. Let's work a little bit with that. Short examples. Let's see, Katia. 
Yes, teacher. Tell me, Katia, have you ever been in another country? Yes, I have. Oh, okay. Where have you gone? I have been in Colombia. Colombia? Okay, that's nice. Thank you very much. Now, let's see. Let's see. Emily, where's Emily? Oh, she was there. Hello, Emily. Hi, teacher. <laughs> Tell me, Emily, have you ever, have you ever uh, skipped a class? <laughs> mm, de pinta? I'm sorry? <laughs> yes. Uh, no, I haven't. <laughs> uh -huh. mm -hmm. I kiss a smile. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, okay. Thank you very much, Emily. Emily. Let's see, Basilia. Yes. Tell me, have you ever eaten um, Chinese food? Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Umberto. Yes, teacher. Have you ever been to La Unión? Have you ever been to La Unión? I don't hear you. You got your mic off. No, I, no, I haven't. Perfect. Thank you. Reinaldo. Yes, teacher. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Have you ever slept in your job? Yes, I have. Sometimes. Okay. Sometimes a nap, a little nap. Yes. That's cool, that's cool. Mario, tell me. Yes, teacher. Okay, you work in customs, you were in the border. Tell me, Mario, have you ever crossed the border? Yes, I have. Okay, yes, I have. that's easy. You work right there in the line. Yes, usually, usually. Okay, okay, let's see. Harleen. Yes, teacher. Tell me, have you ever ridden a motorcycle? No, I I haven't. Oh, come on, it's fun. No, it's fun. no, I am afraid. Oh, come on, Harleen. I love riding a motorcycle. I'm afraid. Fun. No, teacher. <laughs> Thank you very much. Charlie, hello, mister. Hello. Tell me, have you ever ridden a motorcycle? No, I haven't. No, you haven't. You haven't ridden a motorcycle? No. Oh, come on. That's, uh, that's, uh, okay. Well, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Now, guys, uh, look. Thank you very much, Charlie. Today, I switched the order. Este día cambié el orden. I did first the, the grammar part. And now we are going to do the conversation. Y ahora vamos a hacer la conversación. I don't know if you, if you check the platform, you notice it. Si revisaron la plataforma, se dieron cuenta. But it was because I wanted you to get used to the, to the expression. So now that you see the conversation, it's going to be easy. Before we go to the conversation, tell me, is there any question? ¿Hay alguna pregunta? No? Okay, let's go straight to it. As usually, if somebody can take a screenshot, I will appreciate it because my camera is bad. Okay, let's see. Let me share with you. Hi everyone, a conversation will be listened to in order to practice present perfect and simple past at the same time. Notice how they use both tenses during this conversation. Listen and repeat. Listen and practice. Ah. 
I'm sorry I'm late. Have you been here long? No, only for a few minutes. Have you chosen a restaurant yet? I can't decide. Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? No, I haven't. Is it good? It's delicious. I've had it several times. Or how about Thai food? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I have. I lived in Thailand as a teenager. I ate it a lot there. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. Okay, let's listen to it one more time. People passed at the same time. Notice how they use both tenses during this conversation. Listen and repeat. Listen and practice. I'm sorry I'm late. Have you been here long? No, only for a few minutes. Have you chosen a restaurant yet? I can't decide. Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? No, I haven't. Is it good? It's delicious. I've had it several times. Or how about Thai food? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I have. I lived in Thailand as a teenager. I ate it a lot there. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. Okay, let's see. Any question about the vocabulary, guys? Teacher, I can see the, the, war, the words. Yeah, they are a little bit blurry. Están un poquito blurry. Let me read for you. I am sorry, I'm late. Have you been here long? Not, not only for a few minutes. Oh, let me see if somebody got... Uh, let me see how, that, how does it look in my camera. Hmm. Oh, it's even worse. Just give me a second. Okay, this is the best I can do. I'm going to send it in the in the group, but if you can get a better one, will be nice. There we go. Yes. I I can try to check. I'm sorry. Can I try to? You got a screenshot? Tienen in a screenshot? The platform. It yeah, it is in the platform, is it? It's actually the conversation is in the platform. It's the section 5.6. You can check it there in the platform also. I sent it to the group already. Se las envié al grupo también. So you can check it out. Okay? Yes, But, I, can, I can. Okay, now, uh, vocabulary. Any question about vocabulary? Let's see. Uh, chosen, chosen means escogido. Let's see what else, what else, what else, what else? I think just that. Let's go straight to the, to the part of practicing. Let's see. Today we are just a few, so we can do it fast. Somos poquitos, hacemos rápido. Two minutes for you to practice, and we can do it. Let's see. Who shared it? ¿Quién más lo compartió? Oh, Emily. Even better than mine. Un poquito mejor que el mío. Thank you. I appreciate it. So let's do it because I want, I would like to explain something before we finish. Okay, guys, please jump in. Let's do it. Oh, how about Thai food? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I have. I live in Thailand. As a teenager, I eat in a lot of there. Teenager, 
teenager. 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 I eat it a little there. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. Okay. Okay, change. Um, okay. Yes. I'm sorry, I late. Have you been here long? No, only for a few minutes. How do you choose a restaurant? Yeah. Uh, I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. Okay. Uh, change. Okay. Uh, switch. Switch. <laughs> okay. Uh, I start. Okay. I'm sorry. I late. Had you been here long? No, only for a few minutes. Are you choosing a restaurant? Hey, Emily, you guys, you got dimples. Yes. Yeah, I, I can see. You have two <laughs> dimples. That's nice. Yeah. <laughs> I just got wrinkles. Uh, <laughs> just got dimples. And I have wrinkles. You know what is wrinkles? What is that? Arrugas. I don't know. Ah, uh, no, teacher. Yes, we do, we do, we do. Let's see. Uh, right now, Basilia and Emily. Basilia, you will start, please. Okay. I'm sorry, I am late. Have you been there? Have you been here long? No. Only for a few minutes. Have you changed a restaurant yet? I can decide. Chusen. Have you Chusen. ever? Chusen. I can decide. Have you ever uh, eaten? Eaten Moroccan food? No, I haven't. It is a good. Is it good? Is is it good? It's delicious. I've had it several times. Oh, how about take food? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I have. I lived in Thailand as a teenager. I ate eat a lot of uh, a lot. There. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. Okay, perfect. I ate it. I ate it. I ate it a lot. I ate it a lot. Sounds weird, no? I ate it a lot. I ate it a lot. I ate it a lot. Okay, let's see. Thailand, Thailand. Look at me, Emil. Thailand, Thailand. Okay, Thailand. Let's see next, Umberto and Reynaldo, please. Okay. Okay. Umberto, you will start. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm late. Uh, have you been here long? No, only for a few minutes. Have you chosen a restaurant yet? I can't decide. 
Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? No, I haven't. Is it good? It's delicious. I had I had I had it several times. How about that? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I have. I lived in Thailand as a teenager. I hate it a, a lot there. I didn't know that. How long did you live the her there? I lived there for two years. No, 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 no. Okay, perfect. No, no, no. Well no. done. Just remember green curry. Curry. Green green curry. Green curry is very spicy. It's a sauce, very spicy. And a salsa muy picante. Yeah, but it's because it gets uh, ginger, lleva jengibre, that's why. Now let's see. Katia and Mario. Katia, you will start. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm late. How you been here long? No, only for a few minutes. Are you choosing a restaurant yet? I can decide. Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? No, I haven't. Is it great? Good? It's delicious. I be had it several times. Or how about Thai food? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I have. I live in Thailand as a teenager. I ate it a lot there. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I live I live I live it. I lived there. I lived I lived there for two years. Perfect. Very well done, guys. Mr. Charlie and Harleen. Harleen, you will start. Okay, teacher. I sorry, I late. Had you been here long? No, only for a few minutes. How do you choose a restaurant yet? I can decide. Have you ever ever eaten Moroccan food? No, I haven't. Is it good? Is it good? It's delicious. I've had it several times. Or how about thy food? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I have. I lived in Thailand as a teenager. I ate it a lot there. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. Okay, thanks. Perfect. Very well done, guys. Now, something that is very important that we remember and that was there in the conversation is this. Uh, as I told you sometimes, uh, the tenses, when we talk about tenses, usually when they explain you tenses in grammar, they explain you just one tense. But uh, when we are speaking, we mix the tenses in a, in a normal conversation. I mean, that's the normal way of speaking. In una conversación normal, combinamos tiempos, right? I mean, you are not always speaking in present perfect. And not because somebody asks you in present perfect, your whole answer will be in present perfect. Okay? Like, let's see, I asked Katia, Katia, have you ever been to Colombia? Please, a long answer. I have. Been. Yes, yes, I have. Uh, yes, I have. Um, I went there, as an example, when did you go? Um, I went there. In the nineteen, no, no, nineteen ninety. No, no. Oops, I think I'm losing you. No, 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 two years. Okay, but the idea is this, guys. If I ask her, hey, have you ever been to Colombia? She says, oh, yes, I have. I Two went years. there. Fui allá. Okay. Two years. Two years ago. Okay, you see? Two years. 
I went there two years ago. So she is missing present perfect with simple past. Usually, present perfect uh, goes together with simple past. Like, look, uh, I have. I have taught English for 21 years now. I have taught English for 21 years now. I, I taught English first at Universidad Pedagogica, then I taught English in a Catholic community. You see, I changed. The main idea was in present perfect. I have taught English for 20 years. I taught simple past, okay? I taught first at Universidad Pedagogica. Oh, that's finished. That situation is finished. I'm not teaching there no more. I taught at Universidad Don Bosco uh, two years ago. No, one year and a half ago. Until one year and a half ago. So you see, I am using simple past in order to reinforce the idea that I gave in person perfect. Like, uh, I ask Reynaldo, look, Reynaldo, I'm going to ask you, uh, how long have you lived in <laughs> Lourdes, right? No, Santa Tecla. Santa Tecla, Santa Tecla. How long have you lived in Santa Tecla? I live in San, uh, 2005. Okay. Where did you live before? Um, I lived in San Salvador in the oh. neighborhood Las Palmas. Okay, Las Palmas, Las Palmas. Uh, next to the Fair Internacional. Yes, I know Las Palmas. Yes, I know, yes. Now I remember. Okay, now listen, listen guys. You Did you pay attention to the conversation we just had? Le prestaron atención a la conversación que tuvimos? I asked him. How long have you lived in Santa Tecla? And, he's, and he told me, oh, I lived there since. Vivo allí desde. And then my next question wasn't necessarily in present perfect. I asked him, oh, when did you move there? Or where did you live before? Donde vivía antes? So you mix tenses and that's normal. I mean, that's part of normal speaking okay yes okay let's see let's see let's see Harleen yes teacher tell me Harleen have you have you ever eaten uh raccoon what raccoon raccoon have you ever eaten raccoon Raccoon. No, I haven't. Do you know what is a raccoon? <laughs> no. Not it's a little animal with uh, black circles around the eyes. What? Con circulitos en los ojos. Black circles. Uh, no, teacher. You haven't. No, I, I never eat it, raccoon. It's the animal. No. Oh, it's delicious. <laughs> No. Yeah. no I we defend the animal. Have you, Reynaldo? Yes, I eat. eat I, I uh, ate. I ate raccoon. Uh, some, how do you say? Una vez. Once. Once. Uh, my father, well, I visited with my father the Volcan de San Salvador. Okay. San Salvador Volcano. Um, volcano, uh, volcano. Um, we don't have anything we didn't. to eat. We, we didn't, didn't have anything to eat. Um, all, all other persons give, give gave, us, gave, gave us um, a soap. Oh. A soap. I don't know what soap. I didn't. But I, feel, I didn't know what soap, but when I finished to eat, it say me is a it was a rancus. A raccoon. A raccoon, a raccoon. Well, I surprised for me. 
Yeah, I have eaten it uh, broiled. Yo me lo he comido asado. It's good. But it's a surprise. Okay. But it's delicious. Okay, okay. Thank you, Reinaldo. Mario. I had a question uh, for Reinaldo and you. What is the taste? It's white meat. It's una carne blanca. Usually when you eat a white meat, people make the comparison related to something you knew. Siempre le van a hacer la comparación relacionado con algo que usted ya conoce. So in this case, it's almost like chicken. It's almost like chicken. Let's see, Emily. Have you ever eaten snake? No, I haven't. Why not? It's, it's, it's delicious. But it's horrible. <laughs> well, it depends. You can eat uh, an anguila, for example. The little slices, fried, frita, mm, delicious. No, teacher. Yeah, it's nice, it's nice. Okay, okay, let's see. And Humberto, we are talking about weird things now. Tell yes, me, Humberto, what, what is the weirdest, the weirdest, weirdest? Es lo más extraño. What is the weirdest thing you have ever eaten? I, I have eaten um, uh, Taquasin. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I remember um, when I when when I when I was a kid. When, when I was a kid. A kid. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's, uh, that's no big deal. I mean, it's normal here in El Salvador. We eat it. Aquí en El Salvador se come. <laughs> Actually, don't like me. <laughs> what about uh, armadillo? Not, not eating, never. I have never. Eaten I have it. never eaten it. Okay, let's see. Katia, Katia went to Colombia. Katia, have you ever eaten yellow ants? Yellow what? Yellow ants. No, I haven't. Con popos. In some countries, well, I don't know if it's in, there's a country in Central America where they do. In Puerto Central America, que lo hacen. And also in Colombia, you can eat them fried. Have you ever eaten uh, enrollado? ¿Ya comido enrollado? De yuca. Okay, it's almost the same. Deep fried, bien frito. The, the bowl like this and you eat it. Cool. And Katia says, no way. Okay, okay, thank you. Let's see, let's see, Basilia. Yes, teacher. Tell me, Basilia, have you ever gone to a discotheque? No, I haven't. Ah. I like, I like that, but I haven't gone to a discotheque. The husband is there. Por ahí anda el esposo. Yes. I'm kidding, he I'm like, kidding. He likes to dance. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much, Basilia. Okay, so what I wanted to realize is this. If you see, I know that at the beginning, present perfect sounds like something very difficult, no? When you see the structure and everything, but actually when we put it into practice, you see it's applied in very simple conversations. And it's an idea that for you, it's easy to work with. I'm sorry, I will explain something in Spanish. Eh, el objetivo de esto era que nos diéramos cuenta que al inicio cuando nos ponen el tema presente perfecto lo vemos como algo complicado al ver la estructura lo vemos como raro ¿verdad? pero si se fijan en una conversación normal, easy ¿no? it's very simple, I mean guys, you have been using it and actually since one week ago 
I have a, I started using it in the our conversation. Lo vi hace más de una semana lo vengo usando en las conversaciones. Like, uh, what have you done today? Le, algunos hacen la pregunta, ¿qué han hecho ahora? Okay. Small, in a small sentences. And you recognize it, you use it. So remember, everything, any new topic you get in English, always the key is to practice. Cualquier tema nuevo, structure, practice. That's the key. Eso es lo que nos va a ayudar. Okay? Okay, guys, let's see. Remember, please, I expect for you on Monday. Los espero el día lunes. We still have one part to cover. We are going to work with for and since, specifically with for and since, okay? We are going to structure sentences with that. So thank you very much. I really appreciate you being here in the class. See you on Monday. Have a good weekend. Bye bye. Bye bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Take care. Bye, -bye. bye everybody. Bye, Elizabeth. Bye, teacher. Bye. Sorry por, por conectarme tarde, pero la lluvia aquí no se escucha nada. Oh, I wish it were raining here. Deseara que acá lloviera. It's hot. No, ahí se fue la luz. Oops. Sorry. No problem. Bye, See you. Good Bye. Night.